So wait, time now for your morning headlines. Former Brazilian President Jair Bolsonaro was convicted Thursday for attempting to overturn Brazil's 2022 presidential election. He was sentenced to more than 27 years in prison and prosecutors argued he supported actions that would have led to violence in the assassination of then president-elect Luis Ignacio Lula da Silva. Protesters were seen in the days leading up to the verdict with thousands turning out to support him over the weekend. And the Federal Trade Commission has launched an inquiry into chatbots and potential harms to children. The agency sent letters to multiple digital tech giants, including Facebook, owner Meta, and ChatGPT creators OpenAI, asking them to explain what steps they've taken to evaluate the safety of their chatbots when acting as companions. The move comes as the ChatGPT has owner, or ChatGPT that is, has vowed to make changes after the company was sued by the family of a teen boy, alleging the chatbot led to a suicide. Some of the companies involved tell CBS News they will cooperate with the FTC. And nearly 6,000 Toyota and Lexus models have been recalled due to issues with the vehicle's display panel. The automaker says the instrument screen could stay blank at startup, depriving drivers of vital indicators, which could increase the risk of a crash or injuries. Owners will be contacted by NIP in November and take effective vehicles to the dealership for a free repair. And take a look at this. A new study suggests that a collision between two black holes has confirmed a decades-old prediction by legendary phys physicists Albert Einstein and Stephen Hawking. Researchers spotted the event early this year after an observatory detected a gravitational wave. Now, these faint ripples in space-time are produced when two black holes slam into each other. The waves were recorded 10 years ago, but researchers say this particular event is the clearest one yet.